We're going to start today with talking about liability insurance. Liability insurance is the piece of that auto policy that protects you. What it does is it will take care of any sort of uh, claims or payments that you are legally responsible to of somebody else for either bodily injury or property damage. The reality is, is nobody wants to have an auto accident. You know, it's called exactly that, an accident. You know, no prudent person wants to either have one or even plans to ever have one, but they just happen. You know, things just happen. It's a very distracted world, you know, and there's lots of things going on. Sometimes it just happens. Well, there's two different types of policies that you can get as far as the liability limits are concerned. One of them is a CSL or a combined single limits, which is not very common. Or the more common that you probably have is a split limit. Now, the split limits are typically listed out as some sort of limits like either 100,000, 300,000 versus uh, slash 100,000, or maybe it's even higher than that, such as 250,000, 500,000, and then 100,000. Now, what those numbers represent are the different limits of coverage that you have for each one of those different types of incidences can ha that can happen. So, let's just break that down a little bit. The first number, 100,000, that is the liability limit for bodily injury per person. That's per person is the first number. The second number is bodily injury per accident. So that would be for any, all the different people concerned in that one accident. You have that single person limit, then you have an accident limit. Well, that third number is for property damage, and that is a per accident limit. So it's so let's say that you have 100, 300, 100, that is gonna be 100,000 100, bodily injury per person, 300,000 bodily injury per accident, and then 100,000 property damage per accident. You know, regarding the CSL or the combined single limits that I mentioned before, those aren't very common, but those policies basically is really similar to the split limits, except for you just have one bucket that all of the and basically one limit that all of the claims, regardless of its bodily injury or property damage, is paid from. So just understand that difference. But you, you don't typically see, see those very often. Understand that these limits represent the maximum that your policy is gonna pay. So basically, if you have a 100, 300, 100, the most that policy is gonna pay is 100,000 for bodily injury for a single accident. You also need to understand that that limit is gonna be the cap that they're gonna pay. So if you have a claim that exceeds whatever your limit is, you are gonna become personally responsible for whatever that balance is. So let's say that maybe you have lower liability limits, let's say 25, 50, 25, and you have an accident where 25,000 is all the property damage you have and you hit somebody, you, you damage someone's brand new vehicle. You know, it's hard to find a vehicle that's gonna be under you know, $25,000, that's brand new. You would become personally responsible for whatever was over that $25,000. Here are a few key takeaways from this talk. One is that your personal, your personal auto policy is there for your protection. It is to take care of your legal responsibility for bodily injury and for property damage. Those limits are the maximum it's going to pay you would become personally responsible for any, any sort of claims or payments beyond that. The last thing is that I want you to take away from this is that if you, ha if you need to save money on your insurance, this is not the best place to do it. The liability limits from one limit to another typically are not very large. You usually can do better if you will decide to take higher deductibles on your comprehensive and collision or maybe offer some coverages somewhere else. Well, I hope this video has helped you. Um, please reach out to us anytime. We'll be glad to help you out. You can call us, text us uh, at 318-336-5202. You can also look us up on Facebook or go to www.readinsla.com. Uh, feel free to reach out to us. We'd be glad to help you out with your insurance. So thanks for watching. Have a good day.